Well, good morning and welcome to Waveney Valley Lakes. I'm down here for a day session today. And the main reason I'm here, I've got the new Advanta Carp rods with me. Now I've been using these rods for a few weeks now. I've had a couple of previous sessions with them and I've been really impressed. But whilst I'm here today, there's both carp and catfish in this particular lake. I'm probably leaning more towards carp, but I'd take a catfish as well. But whilst I'm trying to get a bite or two for the camera, I'm gonna talk you through the features on the rods as well. So rods are out nice and neatly. I got here early, I've seen some fish fizzing, so I've just quickly got the rods out. I know Amanda is keen to get me recast them to talk through the features, but I'm gonna let them fish for a little while. And throughout the session, I'll tell you a little bit more about them. Well, I had a sneaky suspicion it wouldn't take too long this morning. It's a nice fishing morning. It's overcast, drizzly. There's been quite a bit of fizzing going on, so I was quite keen to get those rods out quickly, not cause too much disturbance, and try and grab an early bite, and that's exactly what's happened. So now's my chance to put these rods through their paces. This isn't the first carp I've caught on them. I've had a few now, but potentially some nice big carp in here as well. So fingers crossed I can get this one in. And we'll see what we've got. Check that out for a beautiful Waveney Valley Common Cup. And that was caught on the 12 foot, three and a half pound test curve rod. And they're a rod that can be used for long range fishing, but they're also a nice balanced fishing rod. So it was a joy to play that on that rod. And I think I'm gonna slip it back and then I'll tell you about a few more features that those rods have that stand out for me. But whilst I get this rod back out on the spot, I'm going to talk about the features that stand out for me and what makes them such nice carp rods. So the first thing is what I really like are these minima style guides. They do two things. They make the rod a lot lighter when it's in your hand. So when you plan the fish, the rod's a lot lighter. And more importantly, I believe the minima guides make the action of the rod much quicker. And what that does, a much quicker recovery on the blank means you can cast more accurately and you can cast further with ease. And these rods, they're available in two test curves. You've got the three and a half that I'm using today. There's also a three pound test curve. So you've got a choice of test curves depending on what your fishing situation is. Another feature that I really like on these carp rods is a feature that I like my rods to have might sound simple, but that's a line clip. And the reason I like a line clip, once I've clipped my bobbin on, I tuck that in the clip, and what that does, that creates a nice aggressive angle from your main line to the wheel of your bite alarm, increases your bite detection to no end. Well, here we go again, the same rod has gone off again. And probably the last thing I want to mention about these carp rods is the nice understated finish. So they're nice and subtle. I don't like rods to be too garish. It's kind of like a matte black finish with a little bit of shrink tubing just on the end there. The handle itself, where you hold the rod, it's got a nice grip in there. Just in case I hook one of these catfish that decide to try and pull me in the lake, I can hold on the rod nice and tightly. I'm pretty sure this is another carp. It's not fighting quite hard enough to be a cat. So I'm going to take my time and try and get it in the net. Well, it's definitely a good fishing day today. This weather it might not be very nice to be out here, but it definitely switches the carp on. And there we are, a double take. I haven't got that common out of the net yet. It's a good job I brought two nets today because the other rod's gone off as well. And there we are, we've got our first mirror carp of the day and a proper old looking one. Mm -hmm. 
But here's the first part of that double take and a nice chunky common. I'd say this one is over 20 pound. It feels quite heavy, but I'm gonna slip this one back. I did get a glimpse of the other cup as I netted it, and I think it's best described as a character fish. You'll see exactly what I mean in a minute. Let's slip this back and let's show you what I'm talking about. Well, I did pre-warn you that the second part of the brace and that double take was a slightly odd looking carp. He might have had a fight with a catfish when he was a bit smaller, but the fishing conditions on this trip are absolutely perfect. It might be wet and horrible for us, but it's certainly switched these carp on to feeding, which is a lot different to my last trip out. I did go out a couple of weeks ago in some real hot, sunny, still weather, which made the fishing quite difficult. So I never had anything overnight using the 12 foot rods, but lucky for me, there's a little rod in the range that definitely saved a blank on that trip. So I packed up in the morning, went and got the little nine foot retractable out the back of the van, found some fish on the other side of the lake and definitely saved myself a blank. Both the fishing rods cast out nice and neatly, it's time to top up with a little bit of bait. So as well as the 12 foot fishing rods, there's a matching spod stroke marker rod, which has got all the same features as the fishing rod. And although I'm fishing quite close range on here today, I have used this spod rod, spotting well over hundred yards, and it's coped with those distances easily. Well, it's typical. I'm now coming to the end of the day session and it's finally stopped raining, but it's been a brilliant day's fishing. But before I start packing up, there's one more range of rods in the new Advanta Carp Rod range to mention. And that's the fact we do a 10 foot version as well. So if you fish smaller lakes, close to medium range, perhaps that have got some overgrown swims where you're a bit more tight for space, those 10 foot carp rods are perfect. And to match the 10 foot fishing rods, there's also that spod marker available in 10 foot as well. And they're all in stock right now. Whether you want to have a look on our website, you can order them on our app, or even better still, pop it in your local angling direct and have a look at them for yourselves.